scientific mom. Today, we're gonna do an incredible experiment where we grow a black snake out of powdered sugar, baking soda, and rubbing alcohol. How in the world are we gonna do that? Well, the answer lies with carbon dioxide gas. To do this experiment, you will need four teaspoons of powdered sugar, one teaspoon of baking soda, a glass heat resistant jar. I'm using a Pyrex beaker. You will need an amount of rubbing alcohol, just any kind of rubbing alcohol that you will get at a pharmacy, a large Pyrex heat resistant bowl, and tongs so that you can grab your jar. You will also need a lighter, a fire extinguisher, and a nice safe spot, perhaps on a driveway, um, where it will be far away from any brush, any dry materials, or anything that can catch fire. You will be using fire with this experiment, so you want to make sure that you are safe and that you take the proper precautions when you're working with these materials. So the first thing we're going to need to do for this experiment is to combine our materials. We'll take our powdered sugar and we'll put it into our glass jar. Then we'll take our baking soda and we'll do the same. Then we'll just go ahead and give it a swirl to mix everything around together nicely. Now we're going to need to put our mixture into our bowl. And I'm going to do this in a strange way. I'm going to have my jar like this. I'm going to put my bowl flat on top of it and then flip it over. Then I'm going to tap my jar so that I can get all of the materials out. For the next step, we're going to need to take it outside. See you in a bit. snake grow out of baking soda and powdered sugar? Well, baking soda is sodium bicarbonate. And when it interacts with the powdered sugar, when the rubbing alcohol is added to it, it breaks down its properties into water vapor and carbon dioxide gas. The same thing happens with the powdered sugar. It also breaks down into water vapor and carbon dioxide. And what's left is a carbonated salt, sort of carbonate snake. And it grows out of the powdered sugar and the baking soda with a chemical reaction. Now this carbon dioxide snake is one of the coolest experiments that I've done recently. I love it so much 
to take these two simple kitchen ingredients and put them together and get this gnarly looking black snake growing out of it? That is so cool. So I encourage you to safely try this at home on a driveway with a fire extinguisher nearby and make sure that you have your safety goggles. If you do try this at home, I encourage you to share your results with us either here on YouTube or at our Facebook page at The Scientific Mom. And if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to click like and subscribe below. You can see new videos and new science experiments every Friday. Happy exploring!